Hey guys, how you going? It is Andrew here. It's just after midnight here on the Gold Coast of Australia. Uh, I've just finished up in a, in a meeting, which was very, very exciting. But uh, guys, there's some news that's just come out and I just wanted to address uh, a few of the things that have come up with it, I guess. I've, I've, I've already received a, uh, a heap of messages from people worried about what's going on, going, oh no, what's happening here? Is, is everything still okay? And yeah, it is. <laughs> It is. There's nothing to be concerned about, guys. This is what I want to say. Um, and, every, and the title says it all. In every difficulty, there comes opportunity. Now, as much as, and if you're not sure what I'm referring to, there's some, been some news released today uh, on the RSW site that uh, the, the termination of our partnership of, of new and Skyway innovative transport systems. Now, what you need to know is that uh, it was instigated from our end, not the other end. So that's the first part of the equation. Now, a lot of the questions that are coming through, hey, good day to everyone that's joining us. A lot of the questions that are coming through are regarding, you know, what our, what, how, how does it affect us personally? So what I wanted to say is if you've been involved with our company for any period of time, anything longer than, um, anything longer than 12 months, realistically, and, and probably even inside of that, uh, this will have, an effect, but not really, if that makes sense. So let me explain what I mean. Um, so the you'll be able to read the article, it's on RSW, and I'm sure there's, it's already in the heap of groups. You've probably already read it, uh, and there will be a response that comes out from our company to, to explain our stance. And of course, uh, there'll be mention of it on the summary webinar on Saturday night, on the 29th. So you wanna make sure that you get on that as well. Um, but guys, it's it's really, really quite simple. You as individuals, if you purchased uh, an EIP in the starting days that had an allocation of pipes, cool, great. Get your certificates from your back office, download them to yours, that's it. That doesn't affect you at all. When that company does what it does, if it goes public, when it goes public, uh, when it starts paying um, dividends, if it starts doing that, then they're still yours. There's nothing changed there whatsoever. If you've purchased them in the, if you've purchased an EIP in the last 12 months that had pipes attached to it, then great. Uh, make sure that your conversion's done, uh, and, and there's the opportunity for you to do that as well. And anything that isn't converted yet, we um, this will be explained, I'm sure, on on uh, on Saturday night rather, and it will come out in news that there is, from what I've just heard, a, a reserve fund there that you're all covered. So we're all good. We're, we're no problem. So let's look at the flip side of it. We can actually take the positive from this. We really can take the positive from this. As much as um, we, a lot of us got involved because of the innovative transport. Awesome, great. And it's at a point now where it's gonna move ahead. It's, it's, it's like a baby, it's growing and it's ready to leave the nest. It's ready to do its thing and it's probably a lot closer than most people realize, which is quite cool as well. Uh, hey, if that's all you're here for, then cool, that's great. I mean, sit back and what and what doesn't come to your problem but what it does now allow us to do is actually it allows us to grow and move in the direction we need to to be sustainable now there's other companies that are involved with the innovative transport that once that finishes that's it they're done that's it <laughs> whereas our we've got a very very visionary ceo who saw saw something amazing in the opportunity that we had. So he realized that we needed to, and look guys, last year he could see that we were really close. Obviously we'd, um, things had started uh, in, in the UAE and there was lots of projects going on there and there was things that had been announced, which was awesome. And Andre realized that it was now time to pivot and start to move in the direction we needed to, to re remain sustainable, to remain, or, or, or to continue to be, to have that longevity. Now, some of the things, and I really don't know if I can say too much about what we just heard on the call, but it is, uh, it's very, very exciting the direction the company is taking. Um, we're, we're looking to external sources to, to bring on some of the, to, to fill the gaps that we have as a company. Look, we understand that there are gaps in a company, and there is in any company that's growing. So we're bringing on those ex in external resources, if you like, to make sure that we have that growth that we need to, to, to make sure we fill the gaps because we realize there are some, which is great. It's all positive things. And, and everything I've heard is all positive. So come back to what's in difficulty, there's an opportunity. We really don't have any difficulty right now. 
We've really just got to get our head around the fact that we're okay. We're still whole. Everybody that got an EIP that had pipes with it, still 100% whole, no problem at all. And anyone that's still got a package that they're paying off, you'll be 100% whole, no problem at all. Uh, and if you've read the article, there is a section in there. I had to read the, this particular part of the section. I had to read it three or four times. I'm like, ah, yeah, okay, I've got my head around that, no problem at all. It is simply, um, it, it talks about the, the stakeholding inside the CAU portfolio of the, the Innovative Transport Solution, right? It's still there. Um, what it states is that it can't be broken up individually and sold off to people. That's okay. That's not what we're doing anyway. What that's doing is that we'll provide it's we'll still provide everything an individual got to that company, and that company is the portfolio. So anything the portfolio gets, we get via whatever allocation of CAU that we have. So we're okay. Things are good. Um, this now gives us the massive space to actually look at where we need to go. We can now get a very clear message as to what we are, what we have, and how we explain our business. It actually cuts the apron strings, so to speak, and allows us to grow in numerous different ways. So guys, there will be an unofficial announcement come out, and guys, understand if you're just joining us, and there's numbers have climbed up here, so thank you guys for, for coming. Um, if you are just joining us, understand that this was a decision um, made from our side not made from the other side okay so know that andre did what he did for a reason uh and for good reasons at that so um and there'll be there'll be more information come out about it the big news is don't panic everything's okay and there'll be more explanations come out over the next 24 to 48 hours anyway guys have yeah absolutely when you're onto it <laughs> let's move on to our next crowdfunding project that's absolutely right that's perfect let's focus on investment consultant let's fo focus on the profession of multi-level crowd investing let's focus on what we can control and, and do control anyway guys have a great night i'm going to go to bed because it's 20 past 12 uh, in the morning um, which is not unusual this time of the week but anyway guys have a good one uh, look I, I know i can see some angry faces coming through there i can understand some of you may be upset it's um it's we, we have to deal with it we're adults we move on we adapt and we overcome if we can't adapt and overcome, then we'll probably never move far from where we are. And that's unfortunate. So we need to learn to adapt and overcome. Once we can do that, we can adapt and overcome everything. Awesome, David. No worries, mate. Oh, look, I, I saw your message there. I was on a, um, on a call, so I couldn't reply to you. And I thought this was the easiest way to get all the information out to everyone. Neil's going to bed as well. It's 20 past three in the morning in New Zealand. Uh, but all right, guys, have a great night. I'm sure there'll be more news come out. Love you all. Um, Guys, it, it's a, we're just getting started. We really are just getting started. If you, if you knew half of what I knew, you wouldn't be able to sleep tonight, which is probably why I'm going to... No, I'm not going to take any sleeping pills, but I probably won't get any sleep because it's pretty exciting. But anyway, guys, have a good one. Take care. Love you all, and we'll talk really, really soon.